Oh, shit. Hell yeah. What's up? What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing out there? I uh, hope everybody's doing good. I we think I lost my voice earlier already. Uh, it's all good. We didn't even start the show yet, I though, know. motherfucker. That's what I get for being all, like, enthusiastic about life. <laughs> welcome, <laughs> welcome, everybody, to another episode of Good Liquor Cheap Beer. This Hell is yeah. episode number what? Episode number five up in this bitch. Numero cinco. Oh, bilingual motherfuckers <laughs> up in this yes, shit. Yes, sir. And this is, we are your hosts, you know, to my right here, we got Joel. And to my left. Is Cinario. Cinario. Yes, sir. And we are from the Antidotes, representing straight out of 6 2 Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> representing and those music up in this motherfucker. Yes, and guess sir. what? We got a special guest this evening. Who that we is? We got Mark Fader up in the house. Oh, um, yeah, what up? Pete? Oh, right on cue. Uh, GLCB. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, that's what I'm talking right about. Now. Good liquor, cheap beer. It's all love. Antidotes fam. You know how it is. I love that. That shit just hyped me up even more right hell now. Hell yeah. I like it. I like it. And I think we're all partaking in a little good something right now, which is what we usually do is drink. Yeah, and we well, gonna be drinking. Be doing <laughs> drink. That's exactly how the last episode was. Uh, so you know what's up? Yeah, we try to make it a catchphrase real quick. Hell yeah! But uh, um, but yeah, I'm oh, drinking. Oh, that's the catchphrase. You know what we we, what we, uh, we do? We <laughs> you know what we usually do is drink. It's all like animated and shit. We have like a drunk guy that just does it for us. <laughs> <laughs> like he's just all drunk. He can't even complete the phrase. Get <laughs> <laughs> no, We know what you do. do, 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 do. Oh shit! The John Stewart voice. And he has, and he has a. <laughs> For some reason, he has a speech impediment. So what the fuck you drinking though? Oh, uh, <laughs> cut off my speech impediment. No, I'm just kidding. Speech impediment. Hey, we are time squads. Uh, true, true. Oh, oh, oh. I'm just kidding. All right, let's, let's get up in this. What am I drinking? Yes, I'm sir. drinking that juice. I'm just trying to be a little nosy. Is that, that okay? <laughs> that lemonade juice up yeah. in this shit. Lemon and what juice. are you drinking over there? I got this new flavor. It also got the I skull. I never seen that shit. It also got the skull, but it's lemon boost. You because know what? Our Fruit Bunch Boost. I'm getting pissed off right now, dude. Why? I'm not going to say their name. No. I already said it. Uh, Sucks. Uh, too late. Dude, we're all advertising a new, new, new flavor and shit. What the hell? Fuck that shit. Hey, they really need to fucking start paying I'm us. drinking this moonshot I made in my back. In my back. In my back. <laughs> I made this shit. It's 12%. It just uh, happens to be sold at 7 Eleven. Boardwalk sometimes. Empire up in this motherfucker. Oh, hey, everybody. Show. Hey, Boardwalk Empire. Is la- I was about to quit or cancel my HBO, and now I'm not. I said that about Eastbound and Very dope time. fucking series. But now Boardwalk, is down, Boardwalk Empire, that shit's crazy. So hey, Very dope. go out and get your local BBO, because I'm not going to say their name either. No, I'm just kidding. HBO. No. <laughs> and go go watch those shows or whatever. So you know what I was watching on fucking NBA TV, though? Oh, NBA I was TV. I love NBA TV. Playing. Oh, oh, that's right. Dude, that shit was I funny. caught a piece of that game. Yeah. No, me and, me and Mark were at my pad. We were watching that shit. We caught the end of that shit. That shit was crazy, for. I didn't really see D-Way playing. What happened? He got injured. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah, he got injured. No, I mean, I heard that he got in injured. the first quarter. We didn't see how either, early because I was watching like it was in the first minutes. quarter, dude. No, it was within the first like five minutes. Wow. Which is exactly why he shouldn't be playing all hard in the fucking preseason. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like like Beasley and shit against the Lakers. Is really crazy, <laughs> the man. Wolves. Hey, yeah, that's crazy, man. Well, they but, gotta make a statement, you know. One, one thing that I saw though, like I was wondering, I was like, I thought honestly, I didn't even know because I, I had to like move away and do some shit around the house. But I was watching, and I was like, oh, crazy, Wade must be on the bench because yeah, it looked like that's LeBron, what you said when we got here. Hey, I remember that Because we didn't see the injury either I was like We heard crazy. about it And we're it like was, uh, Oh my god That fool got injured Yeah it was Carlos That's Arroyo up, And Mike Miller And LeBron And Bosh Mac Miller Mac, Mac Miller Mac Main It was Carlos Arroyo Mac Main Yeah The whole the usual, The usual squad <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit, Mac Main. No, that's, but that's no, Mario but Thomas. Dude, what, I, what I was no, gonna say though, the fucking Heat look fucking solid, dude. Hey, LeBron looked like he was having a great time leading the court. Yeah, dude. Crazy. No, he was having fun. Hell yeah, he was Alley cherishing that shit. Fucking no look passes. Fucking Miller's all busting threes and shit. Bosch is all dunking. I'm like, damn, fool. Hey, if that's any indication how they're gonna play this year, hey, I hope they're gonna be tired them solid as hell, dude. <laughs> Tire yourselves out. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, I heard Garnett's looking fucking tough, man. That's crazy. the best he's looked in years, is what I. I saw actually. I just want to sit themselves quote. up. <laughs> oh, I heard. Who oh, said in that? The East? Who said that? ESPN News. Oh, what? Imagine. Oh, serious. ESPN News. Yeah. One of our rivals. I know. <laughs> our rivals. <laughs> hey. hey. Yeah. Hey. Actually. 
Mike and Mike, we coming for you. Mike and Mike, yeah. Hey, what's up, but if you want us to be on the show, it's I all good. We would gladly, you know, <laughs> It's all good, invitation. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> no, but seriously, dude, that, you don't, dude, you don't think that, like, that fool was all, like, having a great time? Like, of course, like, like. Oh, LeBron, because yeah, Wade was injured. Without Wade, fool. That's just crazy to me. He was probably like, this is my chance to show this news. Even though they already know I'm a superstar, I get to be the man, at least for, like, for sure, for the last two weeks. I don't just want to just do a hummingbird sound effect. You know what that kind of sounded like? Peter Griffin. Yeah, it did. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know what that is, but, no, nah, I don't know. Dude, if LeBron is really that selfish of a player, then yeah. But, I don't know. I don't think he's that selfish. I don't know, man. Because, uh, dude, I think at heart, because, dude, he's a fucking dope-ass player, you know? Yeah, he is, yeah, I yeah. think he's that much of a competitor. He wants to win, which is exactly why he left, you know? He wants to win. That's why, like, I don't think, he sees Wade injured, he's like, oh, my God, I left for nothing. Dude, imagine. Because he's, like, he's left with Bosh and shit. It's basically yeah. just having another good player, not having another great player. Yeah, like but he, he, knows it was, he knows it's just a hammy, though. It's a ham habit for whatever. Yeah, and they're in the back. East. Yeah. Exactly. Imagine, oh, like, a little. I can't wait for the season to start though, to see my boys, see our boys, purple and gold. Oh my god! Yeah, like, I'm already excited for preseason. I'm so hey, happy it started. I didn't get to catch that one at all. I did catch a little clip or something, but but how, like that game, I they didn't they didn't it's win. It's the preseason, exactly. And I, know, I don't, you I don't can't really front. take anything from the preseason. Yeah, yeah. That's why. That's just crazy though how they were going all hard. You said though, no? The Wolves, yeah, the, the Wolves were going yeah, all not hard. The Lakers, yeah, not the Lakers, nah. The funny shit that I saw, I don't know who the fuck I follow. I think it's like fuck yeah Lakers on Tumblr.com or some shit. Cause I have a Tumblr. Yeah, and um, and that's just shout crazy. Out the Tumblr, I, then. It, yeah, I see. If you're gonna be shouting out hey, the Tumblr, shout out the Tumblr. Keep the real way and shit. Keep it low key. No, but <laughs> scenario dot Tumblr dot com. Right, check it out. And hey, you know what? While we're at it, blog. shout out to Twitter. Yeah, yeah. Twitter dot com slash GLCB show. That's the, that's Let me just go shit. through it. Twitter dot com slash scenario. Yes, sir. Twitter dot com slash Joel. Twitter dot com slash Mark Fader. Twitter dot com slash The Anando. That's the fuck is up, man. That's like Avion Crockett. Avion Bling. Crockett. But yeah, yeah no, they do. The, the Lakers are going to be good this year. But, but what I was saying, though, on Tumblr, dude, that, that fucking Beasley got crossed by Lamar Odom. This shit was hilarious. He got I didn't see that. Yeah, he's, nope. yeah, he was taking it up the court. It was just a little side note. Like, it was pretty funny. It looked like Gasol was having a good time laughing. And they almost, and Fish almost kept the three on. You know what, man? Stark, okay, back. I'm still on fucking Bynum being injured, man. Duh. Still on that shit, fool. See, but we, we already know, though. He's going to be gone for a minute. That's fucked up. Yeah, it's stupid. We can't afford to lose like some somebody like that, you know. Dude, what if the Mavericks come with it all hard? They they got stack big men too. That's They're stack with big men. Oh, yeah, I was about, the reason I bring that up is because I was thinking about right now, like, eh, you know, like maybe it's. I'm not trying to just be nonchalant. It's like, uh, okay, I've already accepted that he did an idiot move this summer and he didn't get the surgery right away. So it's like, fuck it. Like, okay, well, he's gonna come back in a month or whatever it is, hopefully. But um, at the same time, I was like, well, we'll be cool for right now. I know we eventually need him, and it's stupid that he started the season injured. Yeah, no, it is stupid. if we want to like be tough the whole season, we pretty much need him. Yeah, you know. But like I'm I said before, we can win the majority of games playing fucking Odom at four and five and Gasol at five. We can win the majority of games, but there are those top tier teams that you need everybody you can get on that. Yeah, exactly. Clap that motherfucker. Clap for, clap for. You know what I'm saying? That's the truth, though. Dude, buying an injury for a month, idiot. That's a lot, man. No, you know what? We're thin. We're thin at the big. You're heading the right way though, because what I was about to say is like, you know what? There's some motherfucker on the squad that's big, man. Remember we were watching that fool? I'm all shouting a mark on the side, dude. There's a big motherfucker on the squad that What's he's it? on the practice. He's on the preseason squad. Lakers? On Lakers, oh, yeah. Shit. Remember we were like, man, that motherfucker be thick and shit. <laughs> and we ain't talking <laughs> about thick like that. We're talking about that motherfucker. He's oh, a big boy. Shit. Yeah, dude, he's no, a big motherfucker. It's not one of the two rookies. It's not one of the two no, rookies, right? it wasn't a rookie. It wasn't oh, a rookie. Right, right, right. Right? I don't know, but what was, what was his name? Ah, we'll try to look for that shit in the break, but I'm just saying. But anyway, dude, that's that's just crazy though that it's just like it's it's almost here and I'm fucking excited. And it also makes me excited because like wow, we, this is the best time of year. This is one of the best times of year for me. I can't wait, dude. Dude, basketball's about to start and fucking we got baseball coming up, but then NFL's on right now. We're in the midst of the NFL. Baseball playoffs. Dude. Yeah, but before we do triple header, how's today. NFL, dude? That shit was crazy. NFL but. wrapped up the week four. Was it week Four. Yeah, the Hollywood ending the one gone behind wrong. us, like you said. Yeah, the one, the one behind us. You know, we number five, the number four. <laughs> but what happened? With, what happened with Vic Nab? Vic Nab. <laughs> hey, that was the name of the actually. Hey, some that's people were calling it the, the game. Vic Nab, the Vic Nab game. Uh, no, but uh, what happened with Vic Nab game, man? <laughs> well, Vic Nab won. Like we said last year, uh, last year, like we said last week, he's going in with a chip on a sh- uh, chip on a donor. Everything's just gone wrong, you know. <laughs> this the is horrible. <laughs> 
he's got a rock. No, seriously though, it's just hey, horrible. Th- that's just crazy though, because dude, the Hollywood, the Hollywood movie that just took a fucking like horrible turn though, with like with uh, with Vic, that fool like came back. It was a whole glorious thing. There was a big old controversy about him taking over with with Cobb or. Yeah, Cobb, and then um, and then all of a sudden, dude, dude two weeks of playing dope. Dude, nah, nah, dude, and now it's just this like, is the big game, full horrible. Vic standing off against McNabb, coming back to his old team. First quarter, Vic gets injured. Dang. Out. That's horrible. Cobb bro. goes in. It's like, forget everything we were talking yeah. about the whole past couple forget weeks. Forget the whole the Cobb is back in. Yeah. And you know what, dude? He actually didn't do that bad, to hey. be honest. He I would, watched that game, full. I was watching that to He had a chance to win. Well, for like wrapping all that shit up, McNabb won. won. He told Mc, McNabb earned that. McNabb won. Yeah, McNabb earned that shit. Cobb had a chance to win, and he didn't do it. Sure. And he didn't choke. He just didn't do it. McNabb, it's not like he choked. It's not like he lost the game, like, you know, like, I was just like so McNabb was like all happy celebrating with like Chunky Soup or what? He was, <laughs> he was happy, fool. Chilling with grandma soup, on the sidelines. Soup, no matter what the fuck, yeah, that fool was happy, fool. That fool, and you know what? The best thing about Did it, they which, they they no, no, no. The best thing, and that's what I was getting at. The best thing about it, fool. He came back to his old team, and the crowd fucking cheered. For hey, because Philly's a tough crowd, man. They're exactly. Like, that must have felt so fucking gratifying, fool. Damn. Being there. That must have been so gratifying. But did Being they cheer there, him after he won, or they cheered him like, or did they did they boo him at least initially? Nah, nah, by that time, for it was booing Cobb. Wow. It was like, dude, in the beginning, dude, cheer Michael Vick. They're happy, you know. We got a good fucking quarterback right now. He's playing good. He's like, he's playing good. Fucking cheering Michael, uh, cheer, cheering Donovan McNabb. You know, you're back here. We appreciate everything you've done for us. That's right. By the end of the game, classy move, Philly. But yeah, but exactly, classy move. That is dope. Whoever said Philly fans it wasn't, were, no, no, no. weren't classy? It was, no, 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 no. Yeah, it, no. Just to clarify that, exactly. Just to clarify People that. People do say that. That's what I'm saying. When I was, what I was saying about Philly being tough crowd and shit, it's true though. Like Philly, New York, and shit, and they, Delta, uh, and Boston, Boston fans, like Red Sox fans and shit, and like Patriots, like they're all like fucking so in. You know what? Talk about that shit because we're in LA. And we're spoiled and we got so much That's funny that you go into that But uh Dude that's a whole nother subject in itself Yeah so Because I That like, reminds me of baseball right now That, that reminds me of the fucking Laker fans That are at Staples Center Spoiled ass motherfuckers That are like booing our team That's just bullshit When we When the other team goes on like a 10-0 and run And like all of a sudden You hate the team Yeah Super retard There's retarded. a difference between being critical of your team as a, as a fan And being stupid You can have tough love yeah. But you can't be like Such a bad Bandwagon motherfucker That you're going both sides All all fast You know Yeah, yeah. So I Either go want, As soon as we start Like dude Not even losing the game As soon as we go Like we're not on a run The other team goes on a run We're like Boo. That's some bullshit fool That's fucked up fool Because you know what In Boston They want their fucking team yeah. To fucking do good And they're cheering them on Even when the other team goes This is the Like when the other team Goes on a run In, uh, in the fucking Celtics fucking arena The fucking fans get up And they try to like Rile their team up but yeah. Come on, guys, you know? Over here Dude. in LA, there's so many motherfucking superficial Hollywood motherfucking bitches that are like, I want to oh, hear boo. Hey, yo, I want to hear more about this. We got to go. whack ass shit. Tell, it, it, tell us we need to cut this off real quick, so we need to go to break. Motherfucker, I want to talk about this shit. <laughs> all right, cool, cool. We need to go all take all a right, break. Right. Right. I understand, people. I understand. Listen to a good jam right now. We're about to play, so we'll be back yeah, a little we'll bit. Be back. Too. We'll be back on Good Liquor Cheap Beer, Once episode again, 5. Joel Scenario presents GLCB. That's what we is. Hell yeah. Later. Peace. She wanna fight, uh, yeah, she wanna ride, uh, you born with the fire, yeah, she's a ride or die, uh, yeah, she wanna fight, uh, yeah, she wanna ride, uh, you born with the fire, yeah, she's a ride or die, uh, yeah,